Welcome back everybody to the seasonal diet, eating what our ancestors ate, when they ate it, like we were evolved to do. Today we're speaking about potatoes. Uh, most of you watching the channel so far uh, are European, I think, so I'm speaking specifically about it from a European perspective in this particular video, but I'll do other ones about the rest of the world. And we Europeans, we have a love-hate relationship with potatoes. We love it, but hate it if it's too much. We love the vitamins and the minerals we can get, but we hate the starchy, high glycemic index. Uh, we love that it's so easy to grow and so many things we can use it to cook with. Uh, but we have some very bad history with it too, because when a famine comes to Europe, potatoes switch to being the main bulk of our diets, and without potatoes we really would not have ever had enough food to sustain the population uh, boom that happened in the 1800s. We would have never grown as big as we are today. So the reason we have these you know, positive, negative emotions with potatoes is because it's not native to Europe. It was brought to Europe from South America in the 1500s, and within one or two hundred years it became a major part of the diet in Europe. Arguably the biggest part of our diet besides maybe wheat. Uh, so this is why we have a love-hate relationship with it. It's in our DNA. The question is, what were our ancestors' views of this in our diet? Well, before a few hundred years ago, nothing. They had no knowledge of it, they had never seen a potato before, never eaten it for hundreds of thousands of years of evolution. Then all of a sudden, potatoes about 400 years ago become so crucial for us, so most of our recent memories and our DNA have such a strong connection to potatoes. And remember, studies have shown, at least in mice, that taste and smell can be passed down in the DNA up to seven generations. Generation. So, yeah, my thoughts, potatoes are great, and they should be a part of the ancestral diet, but use it sparingly. You know, we have a few hundred years of eating potatoes, but a few hundred thousand years of not eating potatoes. So you can do the math that way and decide how much of those you want to eat yourself. If you're South American, however, different story, potatoes are native to your lands, and I will go into that in future videos. 